Hello people, welcome back to my channel. I am Sanghamitra and I welcome you guys with all my heart. So guys, today's video is going to be a really interesting one because we are going to learn about some of the English words which are actually Indian origin. Right? So whenever we learn a word or whenever we learn a new word or we try to understand a word, we should always find out the origin of the word. So yes, there are some words in the dictionary, English dictionary which is actually Indian origin. So let's learn about them. So the first word which is Indian origin is a bandana. So bandana is basically a scarf which we wrap around uh, our neck and that's actually an Indian origin word. The next word which we are going to learn about which is actually Indian origin is chutney. So a chutney is basically a dip which is made out of various ingredients. It is in the English dictionary and yes, it's an Indian origin word guys. The third word which is Indian origin is guru. So a guru is somebody who is elderly and who has the knowledge and it is actually used uh, in a lot of ways in the English uh, dictionary and it is actually an Indian origin word. The fourth word which we are going to learn about is yoga. So yoga is a form of exercise and it's actually an Indian origin word guys. The next word we are going to learn about is mantra. So mantra is basically repeated way of chanting something and it's actually an Indian origin word guys. So the next word which is Indian origin is yaar. So yaar is basically a friend right so uh, that's how you address a friend and it's actually in the Indian, uh, English dictionary and it is a Hindi origin word right so the next word is khaki so khaki is a rough piece of clothing which is used to make various forms of clothing and it is actually an Indian origin word the next word is chit so chit is small pieces of um, you know anything paper uh, and it is actually an Indian or Hindi origin word. So the next word is dhingi. Dhingi is a small boat or a raft which is used by sailors to actually sail and it's a Hindi origin, Indian origin word. The next word is punch. It's not punch, it's the punch. Punch means five. It is a mixture of five of anything and it's a Hindi, Indian origin word. The next word is sari. So sari is a piece of clothing that you wrap around your body. It's a traditional Indian dress and it's actually an Indian origin word. The next word we should going to learn is shawl. Shawl is something which you drape around your shoulders. It's in the English dictionary and it's actually an Indian origin word. The next word is cashmere. So cashmere is a soft wool clothing. So cashmere material has a lot of woolen clothes and it's actually an Indian origin word. Next word which we're going to learn is an Indian origin is jute. So jute is a rough piece of clothing. You can make bags out of it. You can make so many things out of that material. And it's actually an Indian origin word. The last word which we're going to learn is veranda. Veranda is an open area. Uh, where you can actually walk it's outside your house and uh, it's actually an Indian origin word so interesting right so whenever we tend to learn a new word or you know um, actually learn something new we should always find out the origin so these were a few of the words which are in the english dictionary but actually they are indian origin words so let me know guys in the comment section below if you know any of such words which are actually indian origin but in the english dic dictionary it's it will be really amazing for me to learn as well uh, so take care guys, stay safe, get yourself vaccinated. Until next time, I'm going to see you guys soon. Have a good one and shine bright. Thank you so much guys.